y'all welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be discussing the question does your life have purpose what is good y'all welcome back to my channel we're talking about purpose today i just wanted to make a little encouraging video for you i also want to know some topics you guys would like to see so if you're watching this right now comment below a topic you would like me to talk about so if you read throughout the bible you will see that god has a plan and a purpose for all of his creation we were made for his glory colossians 1 16 says for by him all things were created that are in heaven and that are on earth visible and invisible whether thrones or dominions or principalities or powers all things were created through him and for him. God knitted you together in your mother's womb. He has a purpose and a plan for your life. He has placed a calling on your life. We must seek after him first and then that calling will follow. Because if you're wondering why your calling hasn't been revealed to you yet, maybe it's because one, you may not be seeking him first or two, maybe you're not ready yet. Maybe you're still in that preparation season. But take a look at your passion. What are you passionate about? What did God gift you with? Which of your passions can you use for the glory of God? It is an amazing thing when people use their passions and their God-given gifts for His glory and to try to win souls to Christ. When you read the Bible, you see that the body of Christ is not just one member. It is not just one gift. It is many members with many different gifts. Everyone has different gifts and talents but as Christians we all serve the same God with one main purpose to be soul winners for his namesake okay let's be real we live in a culture that almost revolves around social media and no we shouldn't do this we shouldn't revolve our lives around social media but a lot of times the world does that. They revolve their lives around social media. If we're not careful, we can get caught up in putting our own worth in social media. Like, oh, their ministry is so big and so great and they have so many followers. I can never do anything that great for God. Or I don't even have a following. How do I have a voice? Why would people listen to me? Listen guys, we do not have to have a big greatly known ministry to serve his kingdom and to live a full life unto God. A great ministry and life testimony is just to fulfill the Great Commission. Number one, that you're serving God with all of your heart, mind, soul, and strength, and you're, you're loving Him with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, and that you're pursuing God and you're having a relationship with Him. But a great ministry is just fulfilling the Great Commission. It's living your life sold out to Jesus Christ, that your life is a daily witness. That one follower that you may have you can make a difference in their life. Wherever you go, be a light and a witness to other people. Don't sit back idle and wait for opportunities to go and spread the gospel. We should be seeking opportunities out. Guys, there is drowning people in the world. They're drowning. They're looking for answers. They feel an emptiness that nothing that they've tried can truly fill. They try to run to material things because they don't know. They truly don't know that there's a creator that loves them so much that he he died for them and he cares for them and he wants to save them so that they may have eternal life and live with him forever he wants to have a relationship with his creation but there is drowning people drowning people out there and their destination is either going to be heaven or hell it's the truth it's what the bible says and as christians we have the life preserver we know the way how they can be saved we know that they need jesus so why not reach out to them and tell them the gospel of jesus christ you don't have to have a following like i said before but whatever your platform is use it to proclaim his name and not your own don't promote your name promote his name it's all for his glory and honor and praise. I pray that this channel that you guys are watching right now, I pray that this channel is always used for his glory and his honor and that God would use me and this and all of you guys to proclaim his gospel, to proclaim his word. Following Jesus, it's not easy. He never promised it would be easy, but it's so worth it. So guys, I cannot stress enough how important Bible study is and spending time with God. It is so important it is one of the most important things the most important thing you can do in your day is to spend time with god stay in the word guys 
Stay in prayer. God can use you to change anyone's life around you. God can use you for his glory. He has a purpose and a plan for your life. Just make sure that you are following him closely and that you're pursuing him with all your heart. I just want to leave this encouragement here for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave like comments down below of what videos you would like to see in the future, some topics if you have any questions. God bless you guys. Keep looking to Jesus. Remember that everything's gonna be all good and peace out. Every little thing, everything will be alright.